diabetic retinopathy initially doesn't cause any symptoms so the patients will not be aware that the diabetic retinopathy has started or not that is why we um, advise that once a diabetes mellitus diagnosis has been made for a patient the patient has to go for an annual or a yearly retina evaluation when the patients do not come for regular checkups they come to us at a stage where diabetic retinopathy has already involved their vision so the symptoms they usually come to us with is blurring of vision that can be due to diabetic macular edema or that is fluid collecting within the retina or the other uh, important thing being vitreous hemorrhage bleeding into the eye bleeding from the retina bleeding into the eye which is blocking your vision so these stages can be treated with either uh, lasers or injections sometimes surgery may also be required but what uh, patients need to know is sometimes some damage that is done during this stages are permanent even with a surgery we may not be able to reverse the damage once done so if a diagnosis of diabetes is made please get an annual eye checkup or a retina evaluation done without fail so that we can save your vision